What's up, Kat? My name is Micah. And I'm Kendall. Today's a red day. It's March 23rd. Let's get right into your CETV news. Spring break is a few days around the corner, so we decided to ask the students what we're doing for spring break, and this is what they had to say. Hey, yo, wrote a clip. Break, I'm going to go home and visit my family and celebrate my grandma's 91st birthday. What are you doing for spring break? Uh, I'm going to stay here for most of the week. I may go over to Ohio to see some family. You been there before? Yes, I've been there. Uh, I have family in Dayton and in Akron, so I'll probably go over there for a couple days. For spring break. What's up, cats? My name is AJ Brannigan, and over spring break, I'm going to be hanging out with my guys and working out. Hi, my name is Hunter Kenneth, and for spring break, I may or may not go to Florida, and besides that, I'm just be at the house chilling. My name is Destiny, and for spring break, I'm going to be going to Florida in LA, Miami, Florida. I'm going to be chilling down there. Hey, what's up, cats? My name is Micah, and for spring break 2021, I'm going to be working hanging out with friends and possibly hanging out with my boyfriend. I kind of want to go out of town, but I don't know yet. Make sure y'all let me know what y'all doing for spring break and definitely remember to record and answer some questions. What are your plans questions. for spring break? I don't really have nothing planned, but I might work out with the gym and I might go shopping, like see some Alabama. Okay. Hi, my name is Pascal Sanz and I'm the administrative assistant for our principal, Mr. Kosla. So here are my plans for spring break. I have a new granddaughter and a son and a sister-in-law that are new Germany to New Mexico and they're in the Air Force so I'm gonna be flying out to New Mexico on Thursday morning and spending the whole spring break with them trying to you know set up the new house and taking care of my grandbaby so I can't wait. What's up y'all I'm Eli and I'm gonna tell you about my spring break plans. So my spring break plans are to just work just work at uh, my job work all week. Hi, my name is Kendall and this spring break I'll mostly just be working at and then hanging out with friends when I can and my family, but for the most part, I'll be working. I am gonna spend three nights in a city I've never been to, which is Memphis, Tennessee. I'm looking forward to having ribs at BB King's barbecue restaurant. Um, what are your plans for spring break? Uh, my family and I will plan on going down to Florida. We're going to uh, Panama City Beach. Have you been there before? Yeah, yeah, actually we've been there uh, a couple times. You stay down here with the basketball team? Mm -hmm. Do you be having fun? Uh, 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 I guess. What do y'all be doing? Uh, I guess, uh, I guess, I guess, um, uh, playing um, Sounds like a lot of fun with y'all plans this for spring break, but I heard that you're mostly going to be working. Is there anything else that you're going to be doing over spring break? Well, yes. When I'm not working and I have free time, I'm mostly going to spend that time hanging with my family. What about you? Well, I said that I'm going to be working too, and I want to go on a road trip. I think I kind of want to go to Chicago or Kentucky. It's really nice weather for a road trip, but if not, I'll just hang out with friends and stay here, you know, stay in Indy. Mm-hmm. All right, cool. <laughs> In other news, our boys' basketball team made it to state. They'll be playing Carmel at Bankers Life Fieldhouse April 3rd. Last time we played against Carmel, it didn't really go in our favor, but I think the boys can really pull through this time. Micah, what do you think some of the keys are to winning the game? Well, I've seen all the Instagram posts, and I know y'all seen them, but I'm really looking forward to seeing Shamar Avins and CJ Gunn on the court working together. Them two, it's just like, boom, we in it for the win at this point. I'm really getting excited for the game. Well, we asked some of our experts here at LN the same thing, and this is what they had to say. Don't take Carmel lightly like we did the last time. Play together as a team. I'll say it again. Play together as a team, one big unit, and just go out there and play our best game like we've been doing pretty much all season. When we play together, it's a wrap. Game over. Easy. You got to score more points than the other team. Just that simple. First of all, good morning. Wildcats. The game plan to win a state championship, first and foremost, uh, we have to show up as a team. We have to play as a team. We have to understand that, most importantly, we have to defend. Uh, we have to communicate on the defensive side of the basketball. And then we have to rebound. We have to put a body on a body. Everybody got to check out. Mark gets 
basketball, kick it up to Dunn, we look inside the DJ, we swing the ball around, and what I'm saying is this, basically we share the basketball, move the ball, make sure all of our guys are getting quality shots, and then we rebound the basketball on the offensive side of the basketball, that's my name of the game. Go Hey, I think just do what you do, play your game. guys play with good energy and good collaboration, but uh, most importantly, uh, I've been really impressed with just their will to win. We've been down a lot of tough games, but uh, watching the guys come back, watching the guys fight has really been something that I think our will to win, our dedication to get a good job done through those different games. Go Cavs. Thank you. Uh, they got to hustle. They got to play defense. Uh, get it to our score. Kendall, I don't know about you, but I'm excited for the game, man. I'm excited to see what State has for us. Well, that's all we have for today. I look forward to seeing y'all in person and virtual. Have, have a, great a great day, day and, and go, go Cats! cats.